Hello everybody! Watch this video to find out how to recover data from a hardware RAID based on a motherboard controller, how to replace a hard disk, and what to do if the motherboard in your computer has failed. Hello friends! If you need to recover deleted data, view or restore removed browsing history, Hetman Software Products will help you. Follow the link in the description, download the necessary program for free, install it and analyze the disk. The utility will show you the data you can recover, so you will be able to view it or get it back. In our channel and blog you will find solutions to any problem, from installing an operating system or configuring it to fixing possible bugs and errors or optimizing mobile gadgets. Our specialists will answer any questions you ask in your comments under the videos or articles. RAID systems are widely used all over the world as they offer a considerable performance boost and improve resilience. Many users choose RAID to ensure higher data safety for important files. All that being said, loss of data from a RAID system is something that we can't absolutely exclude. It may happen due to several factors, such as power failure, unexpected shutdown, hardware failure, administrator's error, and so on. Regardless of what happened and finally caused the loss of data from a RAID system, the first question to answer is how can we recover information from such a disk array? Let's find out what to do in each of these cases. If the motherboard you have used to build the RAID system is down, if you have chosen the wrong disks when configuring or creating a disk array, and if you have removed by a disk array by accident. If one of the disks within the array is out of order, the RAID status information will be displayed before booting the operating system, and you will see that the array is degraded, which means it's damaged. In my case, this is RAID 5. To replace the faulty disk with a new healthy one, open the Intel Rapid Storage Technology menu and do it by pressing the key shortcut Ctrl plus I or when the computer is booting. You will see the list of all your disks, and you can tell which one of them is down by checking their serial numbers. Shut down the computer and disconnect that disk. After that, connect a healthy disk instead and turn on the computer. Open the Intel RST menu and you'll be suggested to repair the damaged array by adding a new disk for rebuilding. Select a disk, press Enter, and the RAID status will change into Rebuild. Below, you'll see a message saying that volumes with rebuild status will be rebuilt in the operating system. Select point 0.6 in the menu above to exit and boot the operating system. If you have accidentally chosen the wrong disk for rebuilding or excluded disks from a RAID array, such disk will be damaged and all the information stored on it will become inaccessible as soon as the operating system boots. Use Hetman RAID Recovery to extract data from the damaged array. It is capable of restoring data from inoperable RAID systems or from disks that were used to build the RAID. It can read all the information about the motherboard used to create the disk array and then rebuild the damaged RAID system to copy all important data from there. As you can see, the program has identified the properties of a damaged RAID system, rebuilt it automatically, and now it is displaying the detailed array information at the bottom of the window. Before you start the recovery process, make sure you have a disk with the same or larger capacity than the amount of data you are going to recover. Right-click on the array and start fast scan. The program has found and displayed all the remaining data. Now select the files you want to restore, click Recovery, specify the directory where you'd like to save the data, and click Recover again. When the recovery process is complete, you'll see all the files in the specified folder. If the fast scan can't find the missing files, then go for full analysis. This is going to take much longer, but in the end, you'll be able to see all the information still remaining on the disk, including the files that have been deleted. In case of a hardware failure, when the motherboard breaks down, you may choose to connect the drives to another computer, but accessing the information without specialized data recovery software is hardly possible, because another operating system won't be able to identify that the drives have been used to build the RAID storage system. In the Disk Management window, you'll be suggested to initialize or format them for further use. No matter what, don't agree to anything. This can erase the remaining data. Instead, use our utility to rebuild the lost disk array automatically using the available drives.
After that, scan the array and recover the files you're looking for. Hetman RAID Recovery will help you recover data even if your RAID system is completely removed in the Intel RST menu. As you can see, even in this scenario, the program was able to identify the type of the damaged array and rebuild it automatically. All you have to do now is to scan it and restore the data you need. If the program fails to rebuild the damaged array automatically, use the RAID constructor. Select Manual Mode and click Next. Then specify all the information you know about the lost disk array. RAID type, the order and size of the blocks it used to consist of, select them from the list and specify the order. Fill the missing space with empty disks. After all the settings are complete, click Add, and it will appear in the Drive Manager immediately. Scan the array and recover the files you are looking for. RAID 5 remains operable if one disk fails, but with two disks down, the array becomes completely inoperable and there is no way to access the information from such a storage system. However, with Hetman RAID Recovery, you will be able to recover information from an array lacking two or even more disks but a part of that data will be damaged. After all, any RAID type is vulnerable to damage and may fail due to a variety of reasons. That is why it is crucial to have a backup copy of the data so that all your files can be recovered without affecting the workflow. Yet, if things go from bad to worse, Hetman RAID Recovery comes to the rescue with a bundle of features to make data recovery from faulty, damaged or formatted disk arrays simpler and easier than before, and it supports all popular RAID formats. With this tool, your lost data will be back without a sweat. And that is all for now. Hopefully this video was useful. Remember to click the like button and subscribe to our channel. Push the bell button to receive notifications and never miss new videos. Leave comments to ask questions. Thank you for watching and good luck.